Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Chris Scott from The Sun, and here's what we're working on for LowellSun.com in tomorrow's edition of the newspaper. Reporter Rick Sobey is at the Lowell City Council tonight, which will have a significant discussion on the way Lowell elects its city councilors and school committee members and whether those methods should be changed. This subject is also um, pending in a civil lawsuit against the city, so that is a discussion that has been in the works for quite some time. That will be interesting to see how that develops. Reporter Amaris Castillo will have an interesting Christmas feature on a group of young Spanish kids that are producing a Christmas play. These are kids that are associated with the Roberto Clemente League. Um, Reporter Castillo, who is bilingual, also conducted many of those interviews in Spanish. That doesn't happen, happen very much here at the Sun. Um, as budget troubles continue with the Lowell School Department, school committee members are looking to the Lowell City Council and the city side of the ledger to bail them out. It's like, very likely they're not going to get a lot of help in that regard. And out in the Neshoba Valley, there's a big vote out in Aaron Shirley today to override Proposition 2.5 by as much as $7 million for a municipal field improvement project. One of our freelance writers, Mary Ellen Jones, is covering that for us. As usual, if you see anything happening out there, please let us know at news at lowellsun.com.